Hello. It's a little bit different today. I'm recording um, a couple of things that I'm doing with CCC Confer. First um, is my MacBook Pro. And in this particular one, I'm using, <clears throat> um, I went into Google and Google Chrome just to kind of see how that browser would work. And it worked pretty well. And with it, I have my headset. Uh, Sarah Bosler from the library and I are just about ready to get started on here. But I wanted to try all the different devices. Then what I have is I'm using my iPad. Now, what I did with the iPad is I signed in. I went to Google, um, google.com, um, and used that kind of as my search engine. And uh, then what I did was I was actually looking for the... Um, you know, kind of information on uh, the, the, the time we're going to be meeting today. And then I already had Blackboard Collaborate downloaded, and it linked me immediately on my, um, my iPad. And so I thought I may as well try it on the iPhone as well, just to get an idea of how it works. Now, uh, so I'm on the iPad as student one and on the iPhone as student two. Now let's look at who's in the class here. Um, here, this one has my name. I'm moderator. And then I'm listed here as student two. And you have a little icon here which shows it's a phone. And here I'm listed as student one, which is my iPad, because that's the first one that I did. So on here, you know, we've got the whiteboard and everything. Well, this kind of gives a list of, of what's going on as far as the student. Now, the other fun thing is, so this is all my Apple works on this side. And let me stop the tape for a second and let me then move to my other one. Let me see, here's my other computer. Let me just get it on here. And this is just a regular PC. And I'm using Google Chrome in this one too. I'm gonna connect, I don't know if it's gonna let me connect, and this kind of shows you, um, sorry about the, the glare. Maybe if I turned it this way. And what's happening, it's, it asks, do I want to keep, down at the bottom, I, I don't think you can see it, but it asks down at the bottom here, you know, do I want to keep this? Yes, I do, because it's loading Java, which is necessary to run it. And then it says meeting, and I click on that again. And all of a sudden, Java 7 is going to be loaded up. You may have to try to figure out, you know, um, do you have Java already on there? So um, if you do the system connection, it should really help you. There was a problem at one time handling Max, uh, probably a few months back, probably I would say September of 2013, of, you know, how to really deal with Max because they had, I believe, a new um, iOS platform. But this seems to be working well. I think all of the bugs have been worked out. Now, you end up getting information. You know, it says, this is Blackboard Collaborate Web Conferencing. Do you want to run it? And you just hit Run. And then from there, we should get a little icon down at the bottom here that's going to pop up and that's really going to show our meeting. So it's working now. It takes a little while for this to get um, started. So we just have to be patient. It, not everything runs uh, instantaneously, you know, as we would like it to. And maybe it's not running at all here. Oh, here it is. So you see, it does take a little time for it to come up. And it's just saying, this is power. You know, you just get this little message here and it's working. And it tells you that it's loading. Um, and our little part is going to be down here is the icon. So hopefully um, it will get working. My, I, my computer, my PC is relatively slow. But um, we will do our best. And sometimes you can see here, you know, we've got three of these dots filled up and then four and then all of the dots because it takes a while for it to load up uh, with CCC Confer. Ah, here we are. So we've got the connection. All right. It's going to uh, authenticate and goes, whoa, Bev's already in the conference. OK, so that means I've got to try to, you know, do this. Uh, I'm going to cancel this out. 
because I can't go in as a professor on both of them since I've got the Mac working and the PC. So what I may have to do here, I may end up having to sign in as a student. So I may have, you know, the PC, the Mac, and, and all of that. But uh, we'll kind of play with it and see how it works. All right? Thank you so much. And if you have any questions, definitely check with our support.